a little bit more advanced way to spinning under using body movements to get out of side control. This has to be a very explosive move that can lead you to stay on top, go to the back, or even come back, you know, with a loop choke here. I just have to use the momentum and use a lot of pendulum with my legs to explode and get out. Very explosive, but very, I, I believe it's very easy to be done. So what happens is when somebody's here, once again, they try to crush you, they close all the gaps, it's attached to me. So I, what I need to do is the usual. Place the hand on the shoulder to create a little space here so my hands go under his body like this. My hand is across to the other side. My left hand now, instead to just be under here, I'm gonna go this way and grab his tricep. The reason why I'm not gonna do this, he can trap my arm and there will be a problem. So what I do, I go here and I grab the tricep and I pull the tricep towards me and lock it up. So I have his tricep locked and I hold his belt. So basically, I'm pulling him over me. He's totally over me. Now is the job that the legs you do. I have this pendulum with my legs to go and explode to get out, spinning around, and grab the collar here. If I can, this will be fantastic. Obviously, I grab the collar here. All I have to do is go back, moving under, and finishing with a choke. If I cannot do this, we can go straight to the back. So what's happened is this. Once again, he's here, he's attached. I frame, my arm goes under, hold the belt, control the tricep, just go and grab it, drag towards you. We use the pendulum, move out, grab the belt, and go to his back. In any way you prefer to do. I would prefer to go straight, try to do the choke, but this also, is a great position, you're gonna give me two points if I'm right on the back here, right? Hope you guys enjoy, Prats, and have fun. Us.